can't believe I'm vlogging. Can you guys believe I'm vlogging? Like, I'm really sitting here talking to the camera right now. I think that's pretty cool. It's pretty cool just because I've been saying that I wanted to do this for so long. super quick face today i'm wearing gucci guilty and it smells so good like i'm obsessed with this scent i love it but this is what i smell like today it's just like a few things that i still have to do before this trip yeah but that's what i smell like today and for those wondering under my under my um turban it's just braids. <laughs> like literally I just keep my hair straight back, straight back braids. That would probably be like a story for another time because I know a lot of people always be like, why are you always wearing your turban? Or why um why don't you never show your hair? Or whatever questions that you guys be having that be coming to my DMs or just whatever, I don't know. I don't know why it's such a big thing. I don't know why people is so fascinated with the fact that like, who's on name never shows her hair. Like, I don't know, it's, but it's clearly a big thing. And it's been a big thing, cause I'm a big thing. <laughs> I'm joking. But yeah, I might do that for another time. I think that's gonna be another video. Cause I'm not a slave to it, don't get me wrong. Like if I wanna take my turban off today, I'll take it off today. If I wanna take it off tomorrow, I will take it off tomorrow you know i'm not a slave to it but this is what i choose to do and people just be so like weird about it i don't know people is very weird about it. the comments I, I get the fake pages that write me and just like the comments that people make about it hella weird but yeah i feel like all black girls should be blush if you wear makeup and you don't do blush what are you doing this is the finished look. I just did like a light face and some pink lip gloss. But I really feel like doing lip gloss in the climate that we're in is just so pointless. I have my mask. So that's why I was saying I feel like lip gloss in this climate is just so pointless because it's like kind of lower makeup is just pointless. It's just... I'm so over these masks. I'm so over COVID. I'm so, I'm just over all of this, but I guess this is what we got to do. So I'm about to go to Target, well, at least attempt to go to Target and try to get some things because it's cutting close to my nail appointment. Just, I don't know why I started today so late. I didn't even eat yet, guys. Like, I didn't even go to the gym this week. I just feel like, I'm just like, this trip is so last minute. And if you know me, my anxiety is disgusting. So it's just like, I'm just having a like mini panic attack kinda. But I still have to go to Target. I have to get waxed. I have to do my nails. I still have to get tested for COVID. So it's just giving all over the place right now. And I'm just really mad at the, the clothes that I have. I still have to get so much clothes and I don't know where to get them from because I know if I order anything, it's just not gonna be here in time. So. We're about to just try to make something work. Ugh, it's disgusting. I'm so mad. But we're going we're gonna to try our best to get some shit done. We're going to try. We got to get it done, girls. I can't believe I'm vlogging. Can you guys believe I'm vlogging? Like, I'm really sitting here talking to the camera right now. I think that's pretty cool. It's pretty cool just because I've been saying that I wanted to do this for so long. I've been wanting a vlog since, I don't know. We need all natural lighting girls. All right, so Target first. Oh my God, I'm just going off the whim. Like, oh my goodness. I think I'm gonna probably do Target tomorrow. It's giving Target run tomorrow because I don't have a list and I just feel crazy. Yeah, I don't have a list. Um, I'm just like so unorganized right now. So I think we're gonna do Target tomorrow, girls. I think I'm about to just probably do a wax and then go to my nail tech. 
<sighs> yeah. Is today Thursday? Yeah, okay, so it's giving go to Target tomorrow because, guys, I just remember I didn't make a list and I don't want to just be in there just grabbing stuff, grabbing pointless stuff and just giving myself more anxiety than I have. So I think that I'm about to go and get wax first and then I'm going to do Target tomorrow and I'm going to do the nail tech. That just pissed me off. But I just thought about it like, girl, it's not giving. It's my first vlog, guys, and I think I think I'm gonna appreciate just the fact that I just said F it and did it instead of trying to be like a perfectionist like I usually am. I seen a tweet and it was like perfectionists are usually just a disguise for procrastination. And I feel like that's so true. So <sighs> okay. No. 42 minutes to get to this wax place. Wow. <sighs> oh, whatever. That's ridiculous. Okay, so we will check back in once I get to the wax place because I want to focus on the roll and not be a crash dummy. So when I get to the wax place, I'm going to check back in with you guys. Bye. Bye, chicas. Oh my God, we're really doing this. We're really vlogging. We're really vlogging, guys. Oh my God. Okay, bye. It is like 4.40, what time is it? 4.44, 4.44. And my um, nail appointment is at six, so I'm gonna hurry up and do this, and then I will get back with you guys. So I'm at the mall. I don't know if you guys can hear me, but my nail tech is like running a little late, so I'm like, okay, I'm gonna run to the mall, find some stuff for Africa. But I don't really see anything in here. I'm in Forever 21. I just have like two little dresses that I picked up, but I don't know. I don't really see anything else that would be like for hot weather. So I don't know. of Cabo. About to get my nails done. By the best. The bestest ever. <laughs> it's been like three weeks and my nails been off. Maybe four. Maybe five. Oh my god. I think it's been five weeks and I haven't had my nails. Tell them why. Because she don't want to give me appointments. Fucking lie. Tell the truth. But I'm about to have my claws back. This is what my nails look like right now. So nasty. I'm ashamed.
think my nail tech knows is the assignment. Yes. Don't play with her. Play with your bitch. Okay. Oh my god, when did she got this here? Yeah. They're bomb. And if you don't like long nails, keep your comments to yourself because we don't care over here. We don't give a fuck. We don't. We really don't. I'm just getting home for today. The claws are done. It's given Zane. It's given bad bitch. So now I gotta talk like, yeah. Like, <laughs> giving real bird. But um, yeah, so I kind of started on like a late day. I didn't really leave the house till like four o'clock, maybe 3.45. So I didn't really get to do everything that I wanted to do. Um, my nail tech was running like an hour behind. So after my wax, I was able to run to the mall and get just like some throw on shit. Just like three little dresses. So I'm gonna show you. They're so basic. They're literally so basic, but it's like, I can dress this down with sandals. It's just a dress, a knit dress, a knit rib dress. Um, I can dress this down with sandals. And it's kind of hard to find African stuff. Well, it's kind of hard to find things that's for the African weather, which would be like in the 80s and the 90s, because you know, in America, we're in the winter, supposedly, because it don't even feel like winter. <coughs> but I also have this really pretty silk dress. I love the print. I thought the print was super cute. And guys, this is all from Forever 21. I don't know if you can see it. This is all from Forever 21. $20, $15 on sale. Literally just for me to walk around throughout the day. So I don't have to like wear my actual fits throughout the whole day if I do have fits or if I decide to put some fits together. Um, and then I just have a simple black one because you can never, ever, ever, ever go wrong with a black dress, ever. Ever. And I have to try these on. And it like scrunches up in the back, scrunches up on the side, nothing major. It's literally just throw on dresses just for me to have something to throw in my suitcase. Because when I tell y'all, once again, I'm gonna say it again, this is the most last minute international trip I've ever been on. Usually when I have trips like this, I like to give myself like a month to plan, like no bullshit. But it's like, I got invited and who's turning down a trip to Africa? All I had to do was get my flight. Who's turning down a trip to Africa, not me? Who wanna spend New Year's in Atlanta? I'm here every year. Who want to spend New Year's in Miami? I'm there like, oh, this is just a breath of fresh air. And I feel like this is a good trip before COVID really spikes because I just know, I just feel it that it's about to be like a lockdown. If it's not a lockdown, they're going to definitely put a pause on like flights. That's what I feel like. So tomorrow will probably be like the last day of me doing my runarounds. Tomorrow I just have to, um, I need to make a list. That's actually what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna make a list.
and I'll do an, um, an impossible breakfast sandwich. to the list she said baby wipes booty wipes plurex wipes <laughs> it's the booty wipes for me i'm sorry but crowds and just people mm -mm. i get in the mood where i just get like super annoyed and i don't want i don't even want to be in public okay so the first thing on the list that i'm gonna get is baby wipes if i can find it Guys, I've been having fun vlogging, but I just don't like the part with people staring at me in public, like I'm recording them or something. Or like, they're looking at me like I'm obnoxious. I don't know, it's annoying. Oh, being in this house giving me baby fever. Look guys, Pampers. All of my friends are like so pregnant right now. <sighs> or they have babies and then it's just me. No babies. Wait, I don't know where wipes would be at though. I know I'm not tripping. Like, how is it all diapers in this aisle and no wipes? Even down this aisle, like, am I just blind or something? Baby food, baby food, baby food. Like, no baby wipes. Excuse me, where would baby wipes be? Okay, guys, I found them. They were like in the next aisle over. I was being dramatic, but I'm gonna get these flushable toddler wipes. Cause I feel like the toddler wipes is more sensitive for um they make them more sensitive for babies so anything that's more sensitive is good because I don't like a lot of stuff down there my pH balance is not about to be off work wait actually I changed my mind I'm gonna get this brand because I like how it mentioned pH balance what I just was saying so I'm gonna get this brand and I feel like 72 wipes would be enough for a week like nobody's using a bathroom that much <laughs> so I'm gonna get this brand instead. But I wonder, is these too big to take on a plane or? I don't know, I'm gonna get these. I don't think they're too big to put on a plane. She didn't add this on her list, but I have like an electric toothbrush, but that toothbrush is so expensive. I do not like taking it on trips, so. I just always get the disposable toothbrushes. I love the disposable toothbrushes because I can just discard of it once it's done instead of packing that hella expensive toothbrush. And this is my favorite toothpaste, Colgate. I love Colgate. I used to love the whitening brand, but I got veneers, so my dentist told me not to use that. So I just use like the regular Colgate protection. And I need dental floss. I don't even see dental floss. And for dental floss, I just do, um, I just do this brand. Because I used to like these as well, but since I got my veneers, my dentist told me not to do that too, so. This will do. 
And for my toothbrush, oh, gee. I'm gonna get a pink one, of course, pink. Oh, but I don't like soft bristles. None of these bristles are soft. Oh, medium. I'm gonna get this toothbrush with the medium bristle. I'm actually gonna get two just in case something happens to one of them. So I got two. I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get a box of tampons too because my cycle likes to play games with me and I feel like it's gonna come on while I'm out there. So these are the best. Yeah, so I feel like my cycle is going to try to, like, get cute and come on while I'm on vacation. So, these are, like, the best brand to me. I love organic, so. You can't go from, like, organic and then start using um the non-organic. I've been using organic since forever. Oh, and someone told me about Honey Pot, but I have not used any of their products yet. If you guys like their products, drop it in the comments and let me know. I feel like I want to try it, but I don't think this is the time to try new stuff. Maybe I'll try their pads or something. Let me see. Um, these are all tampons. Okay, maybe next time because they only have tampons in stock. They don't have the pads. Or do they? Oh, they do. So should I try these pads? Because literally someone told me that the pads in their just all their products are bomb. Like, one is this okay i think i'm gonna try them just because i like to use pads when i go to sleep and tampons throughout the day so that's what it's given let me know in the comments if you guys like these products because i'm going to tell you guys how i like them travel size deodorants they're so cute let me get two no let me get one What else should I get from over here? I'm definitely going to get some exfoliating um, pads for my makeup. Okay, now we're back to Romulus. Mama didn't like mention lotion on the list, but I have lotion in the house, so I think I'm just gonna bring my lotion from the house. But I do love this brand. I'm debating if I should get it now or just get the one that's in my house. But I think I'm gonna just get one now because I don't wanna forget it in the house. I mean, I don't wanna forget it in Africa. And then I don't have lotion for the house. So I'm actually gonna get one to take with me and put it in my checking bag because I feel like but I love this brand, love. This brand is bomb. And for my facial products, I'm gonna get Cetaphil because I have very sensitive skin, so I don't even wanna try anything new, especially with African water. So Cetaphil, this is the one that I use for my makeup. Well, after I take my makeup off with my makeup wipes, I use, I go back in with this and use because I feel like the makeup wipes don't get everything off. So this is definitely my go-to. Look y'all, the next aisle, while well, the next row down, makeup wipes. I think God know that I wanted to get in and out. Like, I'm gonna get this because it's a um, twin pack, but I usually like the, um, let me show you. I usually love this brand. But I'm like, I don't know if this would be enough. I just like these ones because I think they're so cute. And you could just pack them in your bag or put them in your purse if you're too hot and you can wipe your face throughout the day without having to worry about um, bringing a whole pack out. So I'm trying to debate if I should get this or the twin size pack. And I'm thinking I'm gonna probably go with this. Yeah, I'm gonna go with this instead. Cause I just thought about that. I 
think this would be enough. How many is in here? It doesn't say. Oh, 20. I think 20 would be enough for a week. So I'm gonna get that instead. And I'm a Dove girl. I love Dove. Love the bars, but I'm so mad that they don't have the um the single bars. So I'm just gonna get like a two pack. And I love the um original or the sensitive skin. So I think today though I'm gonna get sensitive skin just because I'm going around weather that I'm not really familiar with and water that I'm not familiar with. So I don't want to mix like some harsh soap with water that's not usually like, you know, I'm not used to. Because you know, water in America versus Africa or just anywhere is entirely different. So I'm gonna get this one. They don't have the individual bar soap, so I'm gonna just get the two pack or whatever. That should be cool. But I'm only probably going to use one. And I'll probably just let my friends use another one. For sunscreen, I love this new Tajina spray that I'll be getting when I go like on vacations where I know the sun is going to be beaming. Um, so I'm going to get this kind. I'm going to get this brand. And I'm going to get two, two cans because every time I get them, they run out really fast and then everybody be wanting to use my bottles like i don't know why nobody ever bring their own bottles yes the shade very shady but i'm gonna get an extra bottle for y'all because i know y'all gonna be trying to use all of mine up and i'm gonna grab one of these but this is gonna be for my um purse because uh, the climate that we're in covid i'm gonna actually get two of them So I got some cute hand sanitizer to carry on a plane because everything is just scaring me right now about COVID. I don't even want to play with it. All right, so you know I got waxed yesterday, but I didn't wax my legs because I feel like the legs hurt so much more than um, the Brazilian. So I kind of skipped it. So going back to the basics, I'm scared, but I want my legs to be like hella smooth. So I'm gonna get some razors and I'm gonna get um, some shaving cream. Cause girl, my legs are so hairy right now, but I just could not bear that pain with the leg and the wax in. I just, I couldn't. So if you used this brand before, let me know. Melatonin for a healthy sleep cycle. I don't know the MGs on it because sometimes when it's 10 MGs, girl, my sleep be like scary. Like, I don't know. I feel like I be tripping in my sleep. So I just need like a five MG. And I'm looking now, it don't really say what the MG is. So let me see. Um, yeah, it don't say. Whatever, I'm gonna just try them out and let you guys know. Okay, so I got these because I know the flight is going to be so long, but I'm putting these back because they're $12 and these, oh wait, I'm tripping. These are $19, child. Any pills, I don't want that. I'm going to stick with these. These are $12.49 and um, they're good for sleeping. So these are the ones I'm going to get. Wait, I know I just was talking shit about the um, 10MG, but... This is the brand I'm kind of used to. And I really do want to be asleep for a little minute. So I think I'm going to change my mind again and get these instead. Yeah, I think I'm going to get these instead of the other ones. Because this is a brand that I'm used to. I never use the other brand. And I don't really want to try something new while I'm about to be in a plane. That's, yeah. I'm going to just get these and just take one. Because this 10MG, this shit is going to knock you the fuck out. It's going to kick your ass. And sometimes though, I be having nightmares. Do every do anybody else get nightmares on melatonin, or is that just me? Like, am I just weird like that? Mm. And these ones taste like candy. I don't know if the other ones taste like candy, so I'm really just gonna stick with a brand that I'm used to. So these are the ones I'm gonna get, and hopefully they make me sleep well. And I'm gonna try to use them for my jet lag because whenever I travel, my jet lag is terrible. So I'm gonna just put them in here. Oh, girl, I gotta organize this. This look a mess. Okay, so the last thing I have to get is just bug spray, some socks, and I think that's it. 
I'm trying to scan these owls very carefully because once I leave out of here, I don't want to come back. Especially tomorrow because I know tomorrow's Christmas. I don't even know if the stores are going to be open tomorrow. So I've been in here for like an hour. It's like, I mean, I'm like maybe like 30 minutes, but I'm ready to go. And I'm going to look for pajamas just to see if I see some cute ones, but I doubt it because Target is so like, Target is like such a hit or miss when it comes to clothes. Like sometimes you'll find some cute stuff. Sometimes it should just be hella ugly and frumpy. And then it'd be having the nerve to be like $40, $50. Child, please. One thing about it, I'm going to spend some money, but I'm cheap. I am cheap. And I shop anywhere. Like anywhere that has cute stuff, I'm shopping there. I don't care if it's fucking rainbow. I'm in there. Humor, I don't really like underwear. I don't like wearing underwear. I hate it actually, but on vacation, I feel like it's very appropriate to have some panties on. So I think I'm gonna actually grab some if they have my size, child. Who's still, who's still extra small in the BBL world? Everybody got fat asses and y'all still selling smalls. It's like I'm playing. I love my skinny girls. I think these are cute. No, wait, these are giving grandma. These are cute. So I'm gonna get a pair of these. They don't have thongs, show up. Oh, here goes some thongs. Okay. So I'm gonna get one, two. Okay, so I got four pair of panties too, just because they were on sale. They were on sale and it's like, why not? Okay, so here go to bug spray. I'm gonna give you some bug spray. it's the end of the night and it's the end of my vlog and i'm exhausted i just got done packing um i just got done everything actually this was a three maybe a two and a half day vlog Ugh. i got it done and i'm so excited for you guys to just tune in and to give me some amazing feedback drop some feedback in the comments because in the meantime i'm about to go to sleep i have to be up early not early but it's early to me i have to be up like around 11 o'clock maybe 10 o'clock so with that being said i will see you guys next time and love you chicas bye